Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to use the character Freedom to create any of the 3D avatar and use the Icron 7 to create the facial expression animations and also the mouth VSAM talking animations and export it out as FBX file so that you can use it in any other 3D software 3D modeling software, 3D animation software, and game developing software. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step how to do this. First, this is the character creator tree. I already designed an avatar where I already create everything. I already add some clothes for this avatar. And now it is ready to send to iClone. Open the iClone 7 at the same time once your, your iClone 7 is ready. Add your character creator add your character creator tree. Click send to iClone. Here, send character to iClone. And wait for a while. Wait in your iClones. Now your iClone is loading the stream. It is loading the avatar. Alright, now this avatar is already in, in iClone 7. And here I'm going to apply a motion. So I will click here, apply a motion. Female motion. This is the body motion. Once I play, you can see the body already have some motion. Next, I'm going to create the facial expressions animation. I will come to here, click the face key, and wait for a while. Alright, this is the timeline. Start from the frame 1. I want it to smile after 2 seconds. So I click play. 1 second, 2 seconds. I pause it. And then I click the, the expressions and let, let her to laugh. And next, after two seconds, I want her to to be to be angry. One seconds, two seconds. At this moment, I I select the happy. Sorry, I select the angry. All right now, the angry face. After two seconds, back to the default. The default muscle. Click default key. Now you can see. It is totally about 6 seconds. I click here to back to the frame 1. I play the, the, the facial animation. First, smile and become angry and back to the neutral. Now, this is called the facial expression. Alright, next. Okay, next, I want to create some talking animations. So I must give this avatar some script. I click here to create the script. I can click record voice to record my own voice. I also can click to choose any of the audio file that recorded as MP3 or WAV, etc. But as demo, I will just use a simple TTS. I just key in. The female Microsoft Zira desktop. I key in a few lines here. Hello. Micro. Okay, this is cool. Testing. One, two, three. Testing complete. All right, now I click OK. It wrote, sorry, I should not start from here. So I use the undo to undo it. 
I should back to the frame 1 and start from the frame 1 I create the script click create script create TTS I use the female voice hello testing 1 2 3 testing complete alright now I click OK The mouth talking animation will start from this moment. Hello. Testing one, two, three. Testing complete. All right now. This is the range. Just adjust the range. And next, back to the, back to the frame one. Play. Hello. Testing one, two, three. Testing complete. Now. Facial expressions is already there and also the mouth animations and also the body animation. Hello. Testing one. We are going to save it as a motion plus file. Save this first. Click here, go to the custom, click the motion plus, and make sure this avatar is already selected. Click plus. And it's safe as motion plus two. This is the one that you are going to, to apply at the moment you want to export this. Next, you want to export this avatar as FBX file. You have to select this avatar, double click to select it, and click here, click edit in 3D exchange. In your 3D exchange, you have to wait for a while until it is, it is finished import. Wait for a while. Next, we are going to import the motion just now. The motion already saved as a motion plus. The motion plus file will include the facial expressions the mouth talking animations and also the body animation. You go to the side and you drag down. Okay, you have to drag here until you see the motion library. Back to the icon. Sorry, this is not icon. Back to the icon. This is the motion plus that that you want to apply, you right click here, click find file, it will automatically open by using your window explorer. Okay, again, right click, find file, it will pop out. This is a motion plus tool. The file extension is iMotion plus. Back to the 3D exchange, and you go to that folder, motion plus, you drag the motion plus tool dot i motion plus drag into the animation motion library and release your mouse and make sure you click here and click add all add all to perform once you add all to perform it will appear at here the motion plus two at this moment you can export it as, as fbx file so now i close the rest as demo, I want to export this on my desktop. Before we export, we try to play. Hello. Testing one, two, three. Testing complete. So now this is the motion plus that you are going to embed inside, inside, inside the 3D models and export it as FBX. As demo, I will export on my desktop. Click here to export the FBX file. And browse, I browse the desktop as demo. The file name, I will just name it as CC301. This is just a random file name. I click wait. Before I export it out, I have to select the target tool preset. Now you want to export it as FBX file together, include all the animations. 
as demo I will choose the Maya window 32 bits it depends on what is your target software your target two presets let's say if I want to test the FBX with Autodesk Maya I can choose the Maya 32 bits and at this moment I click OK and click OK again here now 3D Exchange is exporting exporting these 3D models as FBX file now you can see this is an FBX file that already exported on my desktop as demo I will just try with my Autodesk Maya to see whether is this FBX 3D model already exported together with the facial expressions and also the mouth talking animations and also included the body animation now I'm going to drag drag this FBX file into Autodesk Maya and I need to wait for a while until it finishes loading at this moment you may see that your Autodesk Maya is freezing it is not responding but don't worry about this you just need to be patient and wait for a while until it finish load just wait it we just want to test whether is that all the icon facial expression and mouth talking animation can be exported out now we back to the Maya see if it is not yet ready once it's ready you can see the 3d models the 3d model is there so now should be ready so this is Autodesk Maya I just want to have a look see whether whether it's, it's that all the animation will be exported here you can see 24 FPS but when I export it out when I click export I export as 30 FPS so I must change at here 30 to 30 FPS and now I want to turn on turn on the texture I will click here wait for a while now you can see this 3D avatar is already in my Autodesk Maya and now I try to click I click here to play now you can see the facial expressions is already exported out and at the same time the mouth talking animation also be exported out and so always remember the sound the audio file cannot be embedded into the FBX so you have to import it manually so far we already successfully create we already can create any of the facial expressions mouth animation and body animations in icon 7 and export it out as fbx file and that fbx file are embedded together with all the all the animations you can see included the body animation the facial animations and also talking animations all right that's all for today about how to export the icon 7 3d models with facial and talking animations as fbx file so that you can use it in any other 3d modeling 3d animations and 3d game developing software and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my video tutorial if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3d animation 3d modeling and game developing you can subscribe to my youtube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial you will receive a notification immediately see you in my next video enjoy happy animation and game developing see you